Shannon from Creative Chaos in Tennessee, and today I am back with a challenge over on my Scrappy Life. Um, there was a scrap lift um, challenge. I was tasked with finding a layout to scrap lift, and I am scrap lifting the fabulous Becky Adams from off of Instagram. Um, and I absolutely love this layout. It is fall themed, which is also, you know, fall back into is the theme for this month's um, crop over on my Scrappy Life. Links are below. Um, it's a free crop, so y'all come over and check it out and check out the challenges and play along. It's so much fun. Um, but like I said, I am going to scrap lift Becky Adams. Now, I will pop the layout up on the corner of the screen. Um, it is fabulous. It is fall themed, and I did a fall layout yesterday, but I am totally trying to save my fall stuff for October because I want to do fall and Halloween for the whole month for every day for 30 days of sketches. So, I've been trying to hold off. Um, so, I am going to use a fall theme, um, not necessarily fall theme, but fall colors and do this layout. Now, I took, um, just some random dyes of, like, um, leaves and berries and things like that, and I cut them out, um, from scraps. And all of these were done from scraps, which is awesome. It started out with my scraps from yesterday's layout when I did these. I, I mean, I was inspired. Like, I'm like, okay, okay, I want to go with this color. But then, um, I cut out a few other colors and I was like, eh, I kind of want to do it neutral. So, and I didn't even know what pictures I was using yet. Um, and then I cut out Friends Forever because this picture is me and one of my childhood, um, friends She's more like a sister to me. This is um, my friend Tootie. And we have been friends since like elementary school. Um, like I said, we are more like sisters. Um, love, love, love her. We're still in contact and hang out and go to lunch and visit flower farms and all kinds of stuff together. Um, like, oh gosh. I don't even know how long it's been. Since I've been in elementary school. Like, I'm 41. I'll be 42 this year. So, we go back a really long way. <laughs> um, my other challenge for myself was to um, use up swap items. And this one was hard because it's such a simple layout. Um, but I did dig through um, some stuff. And I found these two things. I don't know who made them, but I know that I didn't make them because I don't have these dies. Well, I have this one now, but I did not make this because I can't get mine to cut good for some reason. Um, but I know this came from a swap. Um, and I am, I cut out a circle on my Cricut. I, this is an eight inch circle. I cut this down an inch off of two sides and then I just have one of these papers from that same pack that I used yesterday. Um, a Hobby Lobby um, pack. Um, so I am going to turn off the camera for a second and I am just going to go through and I'm going to glue down all of these leaves. I'm pretty much full on her layout, almost to a T. Um, I'm literally just going to go through and glue all of these down in a circle, but I don't want to make y'all sit here and do it while I glue, because this is going to be a while, as you can tell from the pile. <laughs> so, I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. I have it all glued down. Um, That's a lot of pieces, y'all. Um, but as y'all can see, I just kind of glued it. Um, so now I am going to just glue this circle on. I did ink it with this, um, Ranger Orange Blossom ink. Oh, I got a glue booger. I left my glue open too long. I have to say, I'm very happy with how this is coming together. Like, I love it. Um, 
I didn't know how I'd feel about it. I mean, I, I want to actually probably scrap lift this layout again. And I might do that um, and actually use some fall pictures. It would be so pretty. You could put a picture and then two smaller pictures or something like that just to get more pictures on the layout, which is my goal because I want to scrapbook a thousand pictures this year. Um, and I'm just going to go ahead and glue this on. And this is my old print order because the picture is shiny and I hate that. I usually get matte, but I got ended up getting a big order of like 500 pictures and I forgot to choose matte apparently on the website. So, uh, but they work, I guess. Okay, so I also did make this into a shaker. I just cut a scrap piece of paper and, um, and then added some filler. But super cute. And I'm just going to glue this on. And I have other videos that shows how to make simple shakers. Using whatever. Basic shapes and all that stuff. Um, let's see. And then. Should I put forever friends or friends forever? usually say friends forever I guess so I'll do that so I hope that this layout I picked inspires you guys also and I would love to see what you end up creating um, with it over on my scrappy friends group and I will have the link for all that stuff below um, go over there and check out all the other challenges um, it's been a little bit of a crazy weekend for me and I did want to say I don't think I said this at the beginning of the video this is for um, my scrappy life crop that is going on um, this weekend and it is September 16th 2023 so if you're watching this video at a different point in time it's probably over with <laughs> um but she does a free crop every month um and it's always a lot of fun um there's a couple new challenges there's a, a new challenge issued I think every couple hours so you guys come over and y'all check it out. I love it. I love how it came out. Like, I had this vision in my mind of what I wanted it to look like with the neutrals. And I love it. I think it turned out great. So, I am going to find my dot for that. And I think I will journal. Because, like, I love how she had the journaling. And that was one of the things that drew me in. Having the big title and then the... um you know, all the journaling, but I ended up pulling out this piece, and I decided to do that, so that took up my journaling spot, so I think I'm going to journal around the edges of the circle, so I will post close-ups at the end, um, all the links below that you need, and until tomorrow, bye y'all!